We started the Tajima program in 2007. What prompted me was that we wanted to be the brand owner, not a distributor of a brand. The key focus is monitoring every part of the supply chain to ensure consistent, high quality product all year round and delivering that perfect steak anywhere in the world. Embarking on the program was challenging. It's a slow road to success, but you've got to persevere, you've got to establish the, the market, you've got to make sure you've got the supply chain right, the quality, the processing side of it. There's a lot that goes into it. We buy the cattle from producers throughout New South Wales and Victoria. They're sold into our feedlot and then processed at the Riverina plant. The feeding is a very important part of the, the whole program. Within our Tajima program, all the cattle are fed at the Prime City feedlot, which is located in Riverina region of New South Wales. The cattle enter the feedlot at approximately 400 kilograms and are fed for a minimum of 350 days. All the cattle are hormone free. They are monitored on a daily basis to check the health, the well-being of the cattle. The cattle need to perform. In order to perform, they need to be happy, they need to be healthy, and that is the way we get the most consistent and high-performing product. One of the highlights in this whole journey was meeting the producers. We've met a number of producers now, and we've met some really interesting personalities who are so committed to what they do. The most rewarding part of running a program like this is the fact that you build up a clientele that continues to use the product. So since 2007, we've had hundreds of customers continue to use the product, happy with the product. We've been able to supply them with what they want. Our proudest moment was 2017 when we won the Grand Champion for Wagyu in Australia. The thing I love about my job is that I get to be involved in all parts of the supply chain. It's an uplifting feeling knowing that product that you've produced is going to end up on the best chef's grill anywhere in the world. Our father started the business in 1960. A lot of hard work. Everything was about consistency, integrity, humility, and we've established the business that we have today now.